Okay, welcome back. We're swimming to Kyrie, the cutest girl ever. All right, cool. Let's talk. Whoa, it changed. Oh yeah, it was a moon before, wasn't it? Yep. Is it telling us to do something? Oh, this is probably where he stored the damn thing. Whoa, magic! Gummy, gummy. Obtain Nev gummy. Now let's just run away from here. Ah oh, shit. <laughs> oh god, that would have been a collision. <laughs> oh my god. Go back and join the others. Cutscene. A light at the end of the tunnel. Oh, your grandma's story, right? <gasps> How did you know that's that? Right. We were together. Oh, you that's why funny. he saw her memories. I looked everywhere for you, but you were with me all along. How trash faces. Ruining Finally, this scene. Together, <laughs> this is actually the nicest scene to me, but yeah. Now it's time to get recouped. Why? Yeah. You think it'll ever be the same again between us? Riku's lost his. When I turned into brain. a brainless, <laughs> saved me. He turned into a zombie. Lost his brain. He wants brain. I was lost in the darkness. I couldn't find my way. As I stumbled through the dark, you know, except by I started forgetting things. Traveling my through all of Hall Bastion. Mm, yeah. The darkness almost swallowed me. Well, you kind of would ever get that stuff, Sora, you know? Your voice. You brought me back. He's, he doesn't he doesn't forget I things, he's just stupid. Just <laughs> you, Sora. I couldn't. That's it. Our what? hearts are connected. And the light from our hearts. I mean, it's her seen as cabbage patch faces. I, I hate this. Yeah, I mean, like. I think that's what saved me. Sometimes I start no to wonder. How deep the darkness. Start to think that the fact that so much cabbage faces, I even in close-ups, comes tale. to the fact that uh, you didn't have time to animate all Let the go. lip sync. Instead of yes, you can't go. Problem. There we go. Why finally. Not? Because it's way too dangerous. Come on, Sora. We made it this far by sticking together. You can't go alone. Kyrie. Oh my god. Even if we're apart, we're not alone anymore. Right? I can't help? You'd kind of be in my way. Uh. <laughs> okay. Creepy smile. Yeah. You win. I'll be satisfied if I can at least see her HD Take model one more time before the cutting ends. Now. It's my lucky there. charm. Be sure to bring it back to me. Oh, there, that line. Don't worry, I will. Promise? Promise. Don't ever forget. Wherever you go, I'm always with you. <laughs> I ship it so hard. I ship it way too hard. Uh, let's see what happens in the three. <laughs> Good point. She gets a oh spoilers. Actually, no, not, not gonna say anything. Okay. <laughs> oh, it's, a, it's important enough to be a, a it's story a relevant. Achievement. Oh yeah, final it's mix one of those final mix cutscenes that her own voice, yeah. But I guess that's an idea to what the hell happened to Rico. Yeah, I guess time. so. Can you hear me? I'll yeah. be there soon. Thanks for that. Uh, I have the other Keyblade! Haha! <laughs> the one that belongs to this world! Haha! <laughs> How did he get it? Did they explain that? I don't know. I've been trying to get through to you, but the darkness in your heart kept me away! Oh my god, I'm trying to actually be Mickey now. Yeah. <laughs> What's your heart won the battle against darkness, but it was too late for your body. Oh, that's So, crazy. uh. Sorry! <laughs> That's why you're here! In this place of darkness, where hearts are gathered! Ha ha! In this place of darkness, where hearts are gathered? Like Where's heart? my, um. How's my uh, Mickey impression so far? Fine. I. The door of the darkness will you, will open like... soon, but it's a door we can't enter! It has to be closed from both sides. To do this, you need two keys and two hearts. I guess. I don't know where I got that info from, but we you know, fuck it. 
Maybe you're here for the same reason I am. Maybe it was fate. Of course it is <laughs> fate. What else could it be? I don't fucking know. <laughs> 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 yeah, the tell me. Don't you feel the echoes of their hearts? You already know the answer. Look inside your own heart. Okay, Sora, you can be a little less creepy now. Yep. Yeah, yeah. You know, I don't mind this explain what the hell happened to Ruko meanwhile and giving a bit of backstory on Mickey appearing, but kind of ruins the surprise later on. No, I ruined the surprise. You ruined the surprise? Yeah, because they don't say it's Mickey. No, I mean, I was talking about the surprise of when he pops out at the end. Of yeah, the I know, same with Mickey though. Yeah. <laughs> Wait. Yeah, this way. Wait, do I have to go to Sid? He has to install the navigation Ah, uh, fine! I figured I might as well be able to do it myself at this point. You're still not navigating. I've never seen you change your gummy machine, man. I don't think you know much about gummy ships. Not a mechanic, okay? Not much of a mechanic. Uh, right. Uh, so, Kyrie's cuteness aside, <laughs> we'll ignore that for the moment. Yeah, sadly, we have to leave her behind. Don't forget to keep off Keeper. Good point, actually. Oath Keeper's actually really good. Wait a minute, don't I have Oblivion too? No, you get it later. I don't remember when, but later. <laughs> yeah. Wait, what does it say? It deals Wait, yeah, okay. Enhances magic blows. and summon power. Capable of dealing a string of critical blows. Wow. <gasps> pretty. Yeah. Goofy, get out of the fucking way. It's pretty. Pretty. Who cares now if it's powerful? It's pretty. I'm gonna kill one of these. Whoa. Testing! <laughs> what a Testing. series of critical rules are Testing! Alright, we're good. I'm good. Actually, it's this way. Guys, stop dying! <laughs> yep, no, Donald. Actually, it's more like Donald, stop dying! Donald, stop dying, please. Yeah, I was going to talk about something. Recently, I've, um. been. Heal. Rereading some manga or like any well it used to be an anime some old manga that I used to watch the anime of in the past like um, Tante Gaku and Q or Detective Academy Okay, uh, you found it all right. I'll go fix up your shit. Uh, you do that Sid um, It's about well a bunch of like Detective Academy middle schoolers like just graduating middle school pretty much in Japan. It's different. Yeah, uh, they go to high school right after basically uh, <sighs> and they go into, and they're in a school of detectives, like high class, very well renowned detectives, right? To, okay. to succeed in the footsteps of one of the best detectives in all of Japan. I see. And um, what's the story like? They do classes or do stuff happen? Oh, oh, there, uh, there's a murder seat case pretty much every single time. I see. Like everywhere they go. My only issue with it is that they rea their reactions to death is quite. Nonchalance, I would say, for the most part. Mm -hmm. Like people die yeah. in front of them, and they're just sort of like, okay, whatever. But like uh, they go somewhere, and people are killed there. You know? Yeah. And it's just, uh, like, they kill them because of them. <laughs> no, but it's it almost feels that way. It's kind of like Detective you Conan. Go you know? The warp hole. Um, you gotta go through the warp. Oh, where? Which warp hole? There was a warp hole besides. Uh, Besides Traverse Town. Oh, hello for somewhere else. Whoops. Let's go fight Phantom. No, Yay! please. No, please, no. God, that guy's scared. So how do we do that? You have to go to a cold, I think, and talk to Tinkerbell. Uh, but yes, I remember it very well. But I have her as a summon. Ah, this thing. Right. Um, yeah. Yeah, it, it's really interesting, but the, the thing I found most interesting about it was that as a kid, I thought the yeah. cases and murder mystery stuff in it was insanely complicated. Like, stupidly complicated. Like, it was actually really high-class stuff back then for me. I see. I, didn't, how, like, how I never long, understood it at all, right? Yeah, I mean, how long ago was that? Maybe eight years ago? Oh, I see. But now, I'm looking at it, it's just like... It's obvious. 
Wow, that's actually pretty pretty ingenious, but also kind of easy to come up with, right? Yeah. So it's all pretty good and stuff, but it's just like, eh. I see. That's why it's fun for me to revisit this tool, Kingdom Hearts, since it was... I mean, I didn't even notice the kind of punch faces when I was a kid. Yeah, me neither. I kind of noticed it now when I was looking at screenshots of the HD remake and stuff, like, oh, hell, what's wrong with this face? But before that, this game was basically perfection to me. <laughs> Any other interesting anime you watched? Um... That's one scary part, though. Shit, I'm trying to remember. No, but I'm recently getting in... Well, I'm, I plan to get into a, a new one called Mob Cycle 100. Okay. And what is it about? It's written by the same person who made One Punch Man, like, wrote One Punch Man. Okay. Uh, unfortunately, the art is also... One Punch his, Man quality? His, no, okay. like, original, <laughs> original One, one Punch, Punch Man. Man quality, not remastered not One not Punch Man quality. Yeah. But the interesting thing they did with the anime, supposedly, is that the animation quality is insane, while the art yeah. style is basically the same. I uh, see. But they managed to make it work. Partially because, one, when he started Mob, Mob Psycho 100, it was it was already kind of okay at art at that point. Like, oh, you, okay. You could, it, stuff was recognizable. I see. So, like, they could work with it. Mm -hmm. um, but uh, basically the story is of a... Um, High schooler guy thing who has psychic okay. powers and is literally um, impossibly powerful as a psychic. Oh, okay. He well, just never uses them. Sounds like what punch man? He never way. uses them. He doesn't yeah. give a shit. Okay. He doesn't want. He doesn't know what he wants to do with life. He just, I see. He just has them. Okay. <laughs> and what happens to this guy? I don't know. I haven't watched it. Oh. oh. <laughs> I doubt it's anything like One Punch Man, though, because it's a high school setting. Oh, okay. But it, it's funny because, you know, in, in One Punch Man, they get rid of, like, action anime tropes and stuff, right? They get... Well, in this one, they destroy slice-of-life anime tropes and things oh, along really? those lines. That, that sounds good. Well, I watch much slice-of-life, but... Like, I watch a shit ton of it. Um, the thing about this one, though, they're, like, there's this thing where, uh... I'm making this feel, uh, making this this level feel more epic than it actually is by imagining a Star Fox. Um, <laughs> if you want to, go with it. I mean, that's all I can do at this point. Those will be bored to death. <laughs> One of the jokes that was really funny about it, uh -huh. though. Yeah. Um, and this is hearsay. I haven't actually seen it myself yet, but it, okay. the, the guy explained it so well. I was like, oh my god, this is <laughs> like I can imagine it. I've okay. seen the character designs. It's good oh enough. yeah. Good enough for me. Um, yeah, you know how in like certain animes where there's like a psychic or whatever or people with powers, there's always like this group intended to like this club in the high school. Okay. Who's like hobby it is to try and figure out if these powers exist or would not or whatever and all oh, that's okay. doing the occult and stuff. Like they don't actually have the powers. Yeah. You know that's the thing. Yeah. And it's, I was like, the, the, the main character who actually has them is actually in the club. <laughs> like, crazy <laughs> antics. Um, Basically. But, uh, yeah, in this case, like, they teach, they, they ask him to join the ESP club, as it is, because yeah. the ESP powers, and he declines, obviously, and he's okay. like, no, I don't wanna, and, um, and it, it, it was mostly because they needed a new member, okay. because otherwise they're gonna get closed down, right? Oh, yeah, that happened. So, they, they always seem to need to get, Watch your get head. closed down. So, uh, what happens in this one is they, they subvert it a little bit. Okay. By, um... Like, there's a scene shortly afterwards, they're like, Okay, guys, you fucking ESP club nerds are only playing video games, you're not doing anything in this club. Even not, even if this were a video game club, you wouldn't be doing anything, apparently. <laughs> so, okay. us in the fitness club, the jocks, basically, like, okay. like the, the fitness guys, not like the sports guys. Okay. The fitness club. We, the fitness club, are taking over because you don't have enough members. And then they're like, no, no, no. And then the, the main character sort of, like, thinking about it thinking about it and like he's remembering a time in the past where he tried to impress a girl with his psychic powers but then okay. she actually got bored of him and sort of went to another guy okay like a jock of some kind oh okay and, you me? and he's like hmm hmm I should join the fitness club <laughs> <laughs> uh, it sounds like the logical conclusion though uh what Sounds like the logical conclusion. I know, but you would think it would be the ESP club, right? Yeah. 
That's just how it is because the jocks are bullying them and I should yeah. join them. No. No, and the but best part is the jocks go like, yeah, yeah, join us, man. We're, <laughs> yeah, go ahead, go ahead. And he gets ripped. Oh. <laughs> he, he, different for the rest he of actually it. gets fit, fit, you know? Okay. So it's fucking hilarious. <laughs> Do we have to climb up, or can we save spots, I mean, I still have to travel? Climb. I still have to climb up a little. Yeah. But it's not much. Sorry, Beast, you're staying out of this one. Go get bail for yourself. Ugh. Ugh. I won't have to go through that again. Saying is fine. Alright, cool. And for how long this series has been going? What? For how long has this series been going? Mob Psycho 100? Yeah. It's only been up for like four episodes now. Oh, okay. So it's only been up for about a month. I see. Yeah. I it didn't surprise me. They would want to do something else by the guy from One Punch Man. Yeah, but the, the issue was the art. Yeah. There was <laughs> They didn't have Murata Yusuke, my favorite freaking manga artist, to recreate it in all its glorious beauty. Yeah. He's my favorite manga artist. I loved him ever since I watched the... I, I would, Red Ice Shield. Ice Shield? Ice Shield 21. You read the whole thing? Of course, like three okay. times. I liked it that much. <laughs> I, I, I don't understand why some people don't like it. I mean, mostly it's because the character designs, because some of them are like really fat and weird and cartoony. Okay. But then you, you but everything else is extremely well done. I see. Like they metaphorically represent what the what kinds of special moves are doing or whatever mm -hmm. are. Without having to actually, you know, have them do weird special powers. Oh, okay. It's just like a like a sort of background effect, or like they fe it feels like a bull is charging at them, or whatever. Oh, I see. Or what the fuck ever. Now, how do I get back here quickly? Is there a way? No, of course not. If you don't jump into the gummy ship, you won't be able to jump to the top. No, because I had to go in departure. Okay. No, I don't care. <laughs> oh. I'm not leveling. Fuck it. You'll have first fight soon enough, so no point in fighting now. Exactly. Plus, it's gonna be so annoying to get there in the first place. So. What about you? Oh fuck my neck. Um, oh. Right. Oh yeah, I've been watching an anime lately. Which one? Have you heard of Psychopaths? Yes. Do you know what it's about? Not at all. Okay. Don't fall, Sora. <laughs> yeah. Why are you fighting now? Oh, wait, you need to fight now. I need to fight because I need to activate the elevators. Um, bas no! No! Basically, this dystopian sci-fi kind of thing where there's a Japanese society has created this magic supercomputer that lets you detect where a guy is a criminal or not and give them kind of like a mental stability grade and based on that D Donald Donald D Donald all right we'll just let him do awesome. that for a bit <laughs> and uh, the story follows a, a detective a group of detectives who work basically chasing the people who are criminals okay so what's interesting though is kind of violence I've heard of it, like, uh, is it like a violent series or like I mean, people are just action, disturbing. The only certain parts are when they actually kill people because they they have these fancy guns called dominators, which but you can only use them to shoot people who have uh, are ranked as criminals by the system. Right. And whenever they shoot the, and kill a guy, he basically turn, explodes into flesh bits, and uh, that's it gory part, but the rest of the series is pretty mild in comparison. Well, Why except... would that be the most efficient killing method? Yeah. Why would that be the method used? I don't understand. Yes. Come here. Yeah. No! Oh god. Ooh, that's nice. Play safe, man. Heal. You know, these guys would be easier with Ragnarok, wouldn't they? Would be what? Easier with Ragnarok? I don't know. They're not easy, just period. If anything, if Ragnarok will work better than Arctic Canon. I'm not using them. I know. 
my god! Fucking die! Kill me seven new. What? Kill me seven new. You know, we didn't, we never got Garethy, didn't we? We never got what? Garethy? Yeah, because you get that in Halloween Town. I didn't remember that. What? Yeah, I didn't remember us from Halloween Town. Yeah, that's where you get it. Like, it's fantastically useful for heartless fights, but other than that... Awesome work. You level up and revive at the same time. Use a spell. Like that was useful. Thunder. Thunder works good. That works. Okay. Hello the time. So much fun. Fucking finally. Let's finally finish this episode. Okay. Next time we will make it to Hollow Bastion. <sighs> we'll so. finally get to the fucking keyhole and stick it in there. This stupid key. Alright, we'll see you on the other side. Bye.